welcome back to my channel and if you are new to my channel thank you so much for tuning in please do not forget to subscribe fems can you believe that these are clip-in extensions in my hair these are kinky curly clip-ins from amazing beauty hair extensions they were sent to me and i'm wearing two sets and i have them in a 14 inch and also a 16 inch I received this cute little box from Amazing Beauty Hair Extensions and the box came filled with a bunch of goodies to help me care for my hair. The first thing, this is what the hair came in and it was wrapped up. The next thing I got was some extra eyelashes, how cute is that? I also received a pack of combs, some extra clip-ins in case I wanted to add some more to the wefts that I already had. And then lastly, I also received a care guide with some care and tips on how to care for the kinky curly extensions. Oh yeah, and can't forget about the thank you card. Such a cute thank you card from Amazing Beauty Hair Extensions. Okay, so this is what I did. It's very simple. Just to prep the hair, I used a care guide to tell me how to do it. I used lukewarm water and I went ahead and I rinsed the hair before I used the Coconut Shea All Natural Cleansing Co-Wash by Eden Body Works. So this is me just rinsing the hair in some lukewarm water just to make sure that, you know, the hair is thoroughly saturated and we kind of do a pre-rinse before we do that cleansing co-wash. I'm then taking the co-wash, spreading that all over the hair. And as you notice, I'm leaving all of the sets of clip-ins together in that bundle. This is a full bundle that you see right here. So this has seven sets of clip-ins all wrapped up into one. Once I'm done co-washing, I just simply rinse that. And as you can see, I got one set of four clip-ins. And they're very easy to clip on and clip off. They were secured very well. Two sets of three clip-ins, three sets of two clip-ins, and two sets of one clips. Now I know you're thinking, oh my gosh, girl, how are you gonna blend this 4C hair with this kinky curly hair? Well, it's very simple. It's very easy. My cornrows in the back are going straight back and I just have the clip-ins, all of them, except for the one clip clip-ins going all across my head. And then I left out some hair in the front and all I'm gonna do is simply do a flat twist, y'all. That is it. Now, I know you're also probably thinking, how are you going to blend that track where the clip-ins start from where the twist starts? But we'll get there in just a second. Right now, I'm just simply going along and flat twisting my hair, making sure to pull it tightly, making sure it's nice and neat, and you wanna get a nice, cute flat twist going right on the front of your head. It's very simple, ladies. Doesn't have to be complicated, and you don't have to have any hair left out. So this is definitely a 100% protective style. Your hair is completely covered. The next thing I'm doing is I'm gonna just make sure I secure that twist. I'm gonna twist it back up. As you can see, it's hanging down by my ear, but I'm gonna go ahead and bobby pin that up just to make sure it's out of the way. After I bobby pin it out of the way, I'm then going to take the Gorilla Glue and I'm going to smooth down my edges and give myself some baby hairs. As you can see, I've, I've done that already really quickly. <laughs> and kind of some curls at the sideburns and just make it look really cute and blend well and neat as well. Then I'm taking the one clip clip ends. I went ahead and I twisted those into two little two strand twists as you can see on each side. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use that to camouflage and cover up the track and kind of make it look like it's going with my hair. So I'm gonna take a section and I'm just gonna try to fit it in where I can get it in and make sure I clip it right there. Bring those over once it's clamped in securely. And then I'm just gonna bobby pin it, y'all. And this is as simple as that. So I take one from one ear and go over. And then once I'm done with this one, I'm gonna take the other one from the other ear and go right on over, bobby pin it, secure it, just so it can camouflage. And it is, sim it is, <laughs> it is as simple as that, fam.
As you can see, the hair is blending beautifully. The hair is a little lighter than my natural hair color, but that's okay. I think it looks good this way. I think it looks natural. And you don't see any line of demarcation. You don't see any tracks. It's just kind of seamlessly blending together. And I think it looks good. This hair is super duper full, you guys. Oh my goodness, like I could not believe how full this hair was. This is, like I said, two sets. It's a 14 inch and 16 inch set of clip-ins that are kinky curly and it's extremely full. Like I didn't have to worry about anything peeking through. I didn't have to worry about my scalp or the braid showing. As you can see, as I do this spin around for you guys, it is so full. I absolutely love these clip-ins. They're amazing. And this is my first time wearing clip-ins, so I'm really excited about them. And if you feel like you wanted to add, you know, just a, a little bit more pizzazz, you can take the um, gold clamps that go on braids and you can put them on your twist just to jazz it up a little bit, give it a little more oomph and, you know, just a little more hair decoration. Who doesn't love hair decoration, right? So I went ahead and I put about three of those in there just to add some pizzazz to the hair and you guys, that is it. Look at that. Look at that. She's a happy girl with her kinky curly hair clip and extensions y'all thank you so much for watching see you next time